In today's Gospel reading, we see Jesus' earthly presence nearing its end. And Jesus, recognizing the signs that confirm this for him, begins to reflect on his coming death. Jesus knows that his very public ministry has not only brought many followers to him, his preaching love, justice, and liberation has also provoked fear in the religious and government authorities. Though he likens his death to a grain of wheat sown in the earth that must die as a single grain in order to flourish and bear many more grains, surely Jesus knows how an enemy of the state will be put to death. For me, it is a very human Jesus who expresses fear. And now my soul is troubled. And who, for only a moment, seems overcome by that fear? And what should I say? Father, save me from this hour. But he shakes off that fear and quickly gets back on point. No, it is for this reason that I have come to this hour. Jesus has always made it clear that his ministry was not about glory for himself. It has always been about teaching God's people how to live in the light of God through the words and example set by Jesus for the glory of God. And so we continue on our journey with Jesus, not fearing what lies ahead.